I'm Clay Stefano. I'm the executive director of the Price Center here in downtown San Marcos. And I think I've been a member of the Art League. I'm not, you know, honestly, I'm not sure. I think it's, you know, several years now, for sure. <laughs> Center is a downtown community center and venue that is located just a couple blocks off the square. I started at the Price Center in 2015 and shortly after my arrival really started to try to focus a little bit more on the arts, the visual arts, the performing arts. It had always been part of the Price Center's past but we didn't have so much display space. You know, we had fixed images on the wall, you know, fixed displays, memorabilia, things like that. So the idea of opening up the space and creating a community art gallery is really how we kind of jump-started the new Price Center. And also, in many ways, jump-started our relationship with the San Marcos Art League. I grew up with the arts. I'm, I'm you know, I'm a native of Chicago, so I grew up with a lot of public art. I remember when Picasso was installed and, and similar Chagall and other pieces that came to the city growing up. And so, you know, the Art Institute is was a wonderful museum, still is, that I would visit throughout my childhood. So I grew up appreciating art. I had art in schooling my whole life. But the arts, to me, are important on a personal level because they've always been a part of my life. But, but more importantly, I, I see how the arts really enhance a community and, if you will, complete a community. And so I got involved in the San Marcos Arts Commission in 2012 when uh, they were developing their very first Arts Master Plan. And so to me, it was important because having seen and playing a role in the Arts Master Plan, I could see you know, how it could happen here downtown. The relationship between the Art Center and the Art League and the Price Center has really kind of, uh, I would say, you know, come together much more so over the past few years. As we see working together benefits us both. And that's ultimately why art matters. Um, it's community building, uh, it's creating a place for people to come to, for people to gather, to share, to create. Um, it's a very healthy aspect of living. And so to me, uh, it's a necessity. I really feel that in particular, the, the Art League matters because it's filling a void and creating things that are happening downtown that no one else is making happen. And if the Art League were to go away, then that would be a huge loss uh, in the momentum that we have gained in the arts and culture community in, in San Marcos. One of the challenges we have in San Marcos, of course, is uh, the large university presence. And it tends to skew who we are and what we do as a community, and more and more so. And as I look around and out the window, I see, you know, large apartment buildings going in, whole blocks coming down. Um, and, and that's, you know, what some people would call progress, and I guess I won't fight that word. But I think the challenge in San Marcos today is that we're going all in one direction versus creating a diverse downtown community. And so to me, diversity is, is important, necessary, and healthy in terms of a full, rounded community. So to me, the arts activities, in particular downtown, are really a, a matter of um, survival at this point in order to make sure that the, the concept of San Marcos, as it once was, a, a community that shares and that creates and enjoys this beautiful river and all that we have to offer, is not overshadowed by the university in its entirety. I think the things that the Art League has done in particular in the last few years, starting with Art Squared, the Art Center, last year's Art Scared, and, and things like that uh, are really what make things interesting and happening downtown. And they give artists and others an opportunity to come together, volunteer, meet one another, all of those things are the byproduct of things like the Art League's involvement downtown. I believe strongly in the need for the arts in our community, and I'm, I'm extremely pleased and proud of the relationship that has developed between the Art League and the Price Center and other entities downtown, downtown association. There's a new spirit of collaboration that is really 
starting to take hold. And it's definitely a byproduct of COVID and just the years and years of many of us doing this. And it's finally starting to catch on with other people that, you know, that San Marcos is an arts community and there is something for you to plug into if you'd like to.